video is a full brand review of Regimen Lab. I did a video on their Vitamin X Serum, which I purchased several months ago and absolutely fell in love with. I will link that video at the end of this one so you can watch the full review of that amazing antioxidant vitamin C serum. I also give a more detailed explanation about the brand in that video. After I produced that video, Regimen reached out to me and gifted me the rest of their products. So I've been using them ever since they arrived and I wanna give you my full opinion on all of the products here. Regimen is a relatively new Canadian brand and I love supporting fellow Canadians. They are really taking the science of skincare to heart. I really love their transparent approach of what is in their products and why, and they seem to ensure to educate and innovate, and perhaps most importantly, iterate all of their products. What I mean by that is Regimen is developing, testing, reformulating as they go along to make sure that they're really delivering on the customer experience. That to me is really important for a brand. So today we're gonna to go over the entire range of products, starting with the Tabula Rasa Cleanser, Level Serum, their Wave Serum, their Cream, and I'll just give you a brief overview of their Vitamin X Serum since I've already done a full video on that product. Timestamps are always listed below so you can jump ahead if you're really looking for a review on only one of these products. First up is the Tabula Rasa Cleanser. Now for context, I have combination and very sensitive and rosacea prone skin. I only cleanse my skin in the evening. I do a double cleanse, meaning I use an oil-based cleanser first, followed by a water-based cleanse. And in the morning, I only use water splashed on my face to cleanse my skin. I do this to really maintain the hydration levels in my skin and maintain my skin barrier. It is very easily sensitized by cleansing. So comment below if you have the same sort of experience with cleansers as me. So I was hopeful that this little cleanser would work for me because honestly, many cleansers don't. The Tabula Rasa cleanser has some really great ingredients. In addition to stabilized surfactant structures, this has amino-based surfactants that are really aimed at hydration for the skin. It contains 10% glycerin, which is one of my favorite ingredients for hydration, and 5% betaine, which I love to see in cleansers because it's a sugar beet derived amino acid derivative, which in addition to its moisturizing benefits will help the cleanser to be more gentle, which is exactly what I'm looking for in a cleanser. There's also propaneol in this, which also provides moisture to the skin as well as being a solvent. There are also emulsifiers in this formulation, and just overall, I. Think Think really good ingredients in this cleanser, which in my opinion makes it really ideal for all skin types. Keep in mind that I double cleanse, so I'm already removing all the makeup and sunscreen and everything off my face with an oil-based cleanser first before I go in with something like this. Would this do the trick of removing all of that? I'm not sure. Comment below though if you've used this for that because I'm sure others would like to know. This cleanser is a gel-like consistency and has no scent. I put a dollop in my hand and lather into my face and my neck is just not shown here. When I add water, it lathers up even more and then voila! My skin does not feel tight, stripped, or anything like that after use. The one you get in the kit is 50 mils, which is what this size is. However, you can order from the website 100 mil, which is a much nicer size. Just realizing I forgot the price. Hang on. Okay, they're sold out of the cleanser, so I can't even check the price. I'll make a comment below once it's updated to let you know what the price of the 100 mil is. I think Regimen has experienced a big rush of orders right now, probably from my last video. Just kidding. I'm sure it's from someone named Dr. Dre. If you haven't heard of her, check her channel out. She did a full brand review on Regimen, and I think it sparked a lot of purchases. Let's talk about the Level Serum next. The serum contains nine active ingredients that are really targeting hyperpigmentation while working to reduce inflammation and firming the skin. Basically everything I need in a skincare product. There's 5% niacinamide in this that really helps to control oil production in the skin as well as skin brightening and texture. It's combined with 2% acetylglucosamine that has been proven through double-blind clinical trials to fade dark spots when combined with niacinamide. Together they form this synergistic partnership that is more effective together to really target hyperpigmentation. You'll also find 3% tranexamic acid in this, which is a powerhouse for targeting 
targeting discoloration in the skin. There's also 2% alpha arbutin in this, which is a known skin brightener, as well as a 1% licorice root derivative, which is hailed as being a wonderful ingredient to lighten the skin as well as reduce inflammation. There's also a 1% turmeric derivative, which is both an antioxidant and a skin brightener. I really love the idea of this all-in-one serum that's doing all the heavy lifting for me in one go with all these fabulous ingredients combined together. Now, I use this one in my evening skincare routine and I use the vitamin X in my morning skincare routine. Regimen says to apply about half a pump for your face and neck. Well, I couldn't figure out how to pump half a pump. That didn't work for me. But thankfully, one entire pump did my entire face, neck, and I always do my skincare across my chest, and you should too. Basically, anywhere where you see the signs of aging or skin that could use an extra little bit of TLC, that's where I apply all of my serums. So one pump, covered that. This has a smell to it that I actually appreciate. It doesn't smell floral or fruity or what do I say? Nothing nice? That doesn't sound nice. It just smells real. Like it's reflective of all the wonderful ingredients that are in here. It has an oily texture, but applies to the skin very easily and sinks into the skin beautifully. I did not have any stinging or irritation with it. And I appreciate that all of the percentages of actives are reasonable and not over the top, which certainly in my skin can tend to cause irritation. The size is 30 mils and the cost is $44. I think for anyone who's dealing with hyperpigmentation, melasma, or even post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation from acne spots would really gain benefit from this. For those of you who have watched me before, I did do a review of the Neod Repigment Serum, and I targeted these two little spots on my neck here, which I've still been working on. However, I am seeing results with this on these two spots as well, and that's only with a little over a month of use. So I'm really impressed with this one so far and I, I just can't wait to see what else it can do for me. Regimen says that if you use acids or retinols in the same routine as level serum that you should use level after in order to gain all the benefits from all the products that you're using. So I tried this and actually that didn't work for me. I had a lot of sensitization probably because there's so many active ingredients in this using my acid exfoliation and retinol right away wasn't a good idea. I knew that going into it, but I thought I'd give it a try anyway. So what I did, which actually I think I'm gonna be doing from now on is almost like two skincare routines in the evening. What I ended up doing was doing my full skincare routine with this followed by the wave serum, which I'm gonna talk about next and cream. And then several hours later, just before I went to actual bed, I would apply my retinol then. I woke up with my skin feeling so hydrated and in such good condition and doing it this way I had no irritation but was gaining the benefit of all of these active ingredients plus my retinol. And I really think the hydration in my skin was thanks to these next two products that I'm going to talk about. I'll talk about the Wave Serum first. Holy cow, I love this serum for its hydrating properties. Regimen says they've designed Wave to mimic the skin's own hydration mechanisms. There's 24 humectants in this plus plant and marine hyaluronics. Right off the bat, I was already a big fan because I saw marine hyaluronics in here and I already use marine hyaluronics in my skincare routine from other brands, especially The Ordinary. I love that serum and it features heavily in my skincare routines. But this serum also has urea. Urea is quite simply a superstar when it comes to maintaining and supporting skin barrier function. It is a star hydrator and has amazing natural moisturizing factors. There are multi-molecular hyaluronic acid complexes in here that are known humectants and provide great hydration for the skin, as well as derivatives from one of my all-time favorite ingredients, Centella Asiatica, which is very well known for its calming and soothing properties. Great for someone like me who battles rosacea on the regular. I always applied this to damp skin and I used it both in my morning and evening skincare routines. In my nighttime routine, I would double cleanse, 
apply the level serum, let it sink in, then mist my face, then apply the wave serum, then apply cream. It's a gel-like texture, likely from the hyaluronic acid complexes, and one pump easily applied to my face and neck. I use this both morning and night, and I love the plumped, hydrated feeling that my skin felt afterwards. There was zero irritation for me with this one, and I would follow with the cream moisturizer immediately after this one to just lock everything in. Regimen says you can mix the Wave Serum in with the Cream Moisturizer because Wave works to enhance the benefits of cream. So I did that as well, but actually I just prefer to apply it in layers. This, then cream. The size is 30 mil and the cost is $47. I, I would say this entire range of products is in the mid-range. Um, I sort of liken it to the Neod line. More expensive, but more thoughtful and precise formulations that I'm willing to pay for if I believe that I'm reaping the benefits from. And so far, the ones that I've reviewed, I have. So next, let's talk cream. Regimen's a little bit cheeky with this one. They say it's not a moisturizer and not a serum. It's just quite simply cream. Psst, it's actually a moisturizer. Don't tell them I said that. Cream contains 2.5% pure ceramides in a 3 to 1 to 1 to 1 ratio of cholesterol, essential and non-essential fatty acids, which are targeting hydration, moisture retention, and the skin's natural barrier. There's glycerin for hydration and emollient esters that help with moisture retention and a chamomile derivative that has lovely calming and soothing properties. I should mention, Regimen is a cruelty-free and vegan-friendly brand, but the cholesterol from the ceramide complex in cream is derived from the oil in sheep's wool. Cream is a thick moisturizer. I know it's not a moisturizer. When you apply it over the Wave Serum, it doesn't actually appear that thick, but when you apply it to dry skin, as I'm doing here, you can see it's, it's definitely on the thicker side of moisturizers. Oh, my left hand is gonna love this little special treatment. Okay, they can both have some. I use this in both my morning and evening skincare routines, followed by sunscreen in the morning. Regimen, uh, when are you gonna formulate a sunscreen? There is no scent to this and I had no irritation. And honestly, I feel like this does a really good job at locking in the moisture in my skin. I should say, I don't have dry skin, but I have dehydrated skin and that has just gotten worse and worse as I age. So I feel like it's something I'm just gonna constantly have to be dealing with. I have combination skin, so over the years, I've typically stuck with gel moisturizers, but I'm finding more and more now, especially in my nighttime routines, really reaching towards richer, thicker moisturizers to help assist with my dehydrated skin. I think this does a great job in preventing transepidermal water loss and works as a great occlusive as the last step in your skincare routine. Now, when Dr. Dre reviewed this brand, she said, that she had pilling as a result of this product. I have not experienced that at all. Mind you, I don't wear a lot of foundation, but definitely I wear sunscreen every day. Often I wear a BB cream and pretty much every day I wear a concealer under my eyes. So I didn't have that experience, but comment below if you've had the same experience as well. This is a 50 mil size and the cost is $49. I call this on the higher side of affordable. However, I love it. Do I wish it was cheaper? Yes. Am I gonna pay $49 for it again? Yes. Finally, I'm gonna give you a very brief overview of vitamin X because I've already done the full video on it. Here's my brief overview. I love it. Okay, just kidding. Suffice it to say, Vitamin X is a vitamin C serum with 15% allosorbic acid, ferulic acid, and vitamin E, a trifecta combo that is known to be a great antioxidant and vitamin C complex. All of these, look at all of these are in hairless pumps. I love that about this brand too, because it's keeping the sometimes unstable ingredients that are in these formulations more stable because it's not exposing it to light and air every time you use it. And that's especially true for vitamin X. I prefer using this in my morning routine because I've always just used my vitamin C serums in the morning. They act as great antioxidants and help to prevent free radical damage throughout the day. It also has an additional 11 antioxidants in it. So it's just giving you all that more protection, of course, followed up by sunscreen.
This one has a scent to it as well, likely from the ferulic acid, if you're familiar with other products that have that ingredient in it. It is an oily texture, but kind of like the Level Serum, it goes on, sinks into the skin quite easily. I have not had any pilling or any irritation from this product at all. I think my skin literally drinks it up. Size is 30 mil and cost is $59. What you're getting in this from an ingredient standpoint is totally worth the price. In addition to the sizes and prices that I've given you as I've been walking you through this video, they also have a kit where they ship everything in an all-in-one. That kit is $157 Canadian. Just note that the Tabula Rasa cleanser will come in a 50 mil size in the kit as opposed to the 100 mil that you can buy from the website. And the cream comes in a 30 mil size as opposed to the 50 mil size that you can buy as a standalone from the website. I would have no problem spending this kind of money on these products given my experience with them. Maybe just bring down the price of this one a little bit, please. I'm thinking they must be coming out with a product that I don't like because how often is it that a brand releases products that you like every single one? But honestly, if they develop a peptide serum, a retinol, and a sunscreen, they could have a serious one skincare brand routine for me. Okay, that's not true. I review and try skincare products for all of you so you don't have to. So that's never going to be the case for me. But it could be possible for you. I really think the hydration in my skin was thanks to these next two. Oops. All of these... Look at them all. They're all in airless pumps, which I love. Oh, I'm holding up the cleanser, not in an airless pump. Look at all of these are in airless pumps. Thank you, regimen. I'm gonna go do my skincare routine now. Forgot to turn off the camera.